there, and welcome to the Valentine's edition of Eric Wilson's Guide to Dating. Today we'll be going on a magical journey into the wonderful world of teen dating. Is your dating life a little out of tune? Well, if you follow my three simple steps, you can get it back in line. Step one, accountability. Step two, accountability. And step three, Accountability. One day, after my patented Eric Wilson's wonderful workouts, I had the most genius idea. 999? 1000! Wait a What about the Purity Police? Purity Police. Purity Police. P. P. Purity. Alright. Got him. Oh, yes? Officer Integrity, I'm here for the purity police. Oh. Why have you summoned to me? Well, I'll be honest. Too many people just find me too attractive, and I needed some help in teenage dating. Alright then. Let's go. <laughs> I'm just too tired. Ugh. Don't think so, sir. It's a romantic dinner. Easy Mac and soup. Just amazing. Well, I guess it's time for you to go. <laughs> no way! Time to get this party started! Oh. Eric, let me teach you a lesson about drinking. There was once man, a man named Elisha. He was going up to Bethel, and children came out and called him mean names. They said, Go on up, baldy head. Go on up, baldy head. He then turned around and called a curse upon them, and two she bears came out and mauled the 42 children. The end. Preach it, brother! Now to leave you this evening with the most important thing about this segment other than accountability my top 10 list of things not to do or say on this date. No matter how sincere or thoughtful you think you're being, this one will never work. When I look into your eyes, you just remind me so much of my mother. Number two, I found that only girls can say to girls. Oh, Eric, I am so hungry. So hungry. Yeah, I would go to salad if I were you. Never, under any circumstances, should you ever say this to your date after she eats dessert. That is just gross. Do you just want me to put your food in a trough? <laughs> Next on the list is number four. If you're ever playing Xbox while talking on the phone, try to cover it up better than this. Oh my goodness, Eric. I had the best day at school, but there was this girl that came up to me and tried to tell me that I don't look good in my new sweater, and I was like, uh-huh, and she was like, nah uh and I was like, uh-huh, and she was like, uh-uh, total wrong. Uh-huh. Yeah. Oh, wow. Uh-huh. Yep. All right. Oh my goodness, I forgot to tell you, there's a dance on Friday, and I think you should take me. Uh-huh. Yep. Can't wait to hang up and just play Xbox. Uh-huh. Click! Hello? 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 Oh, baby, come back! Six is not Eric Wilson's fault. It is not his fault that he is a germaphobe, and that many diseases, such as H1N1, swine, the bird flu, malaria, they're all airborne, and he is petrified. Gross. This is disgusting. And number seven is a prime example of a joke that is funny with anybody else but your date. What's <laughs> so, up? How about that Super Bowl? Hey, hey guys, are you hear a lot of fart? Oh, oh, I just started. There's a classic case of going too far, too fast. Eric, I'm so proud of you. Our first date's going so well already. You even invited yourself over to my house for hot chocolate. Yep. 
You have the clown cup too? Yes. Oh, oh my goodness. What? Uh, uh, I, I love you. What'd you say? I said I love you and I don't care who knows it! Here on the top 10 are two statements I have found that never end well. Did you get my daughter to say yes to going out with you? Well, actually, your daughter's the eighth girl I've gone out with this month. You wanna know how I do it? You slap. <laughs> oh jeez. <laughs> so where are you taking my daughter tonight? What are you laughing at boy? How'd I give you something to laugh at, huh? <laughs> you gonna be laughing at my flip about now, will you? <laughs> Valentine's Day special of Eric Wilson's dating tips. And remember, accountability, accountability, and Mr. Potato Head. The following footage is the reason why Eric celebrates Single Awareness Day every February 14th. <laughs> the same thing you just said. Oh. <laughs> Off the top ten are two things I found to never say to the date's father. That's not how you say father. Father. <laughs> <laughs> how? I need a professional ass. Yeah, but that Super Bowl. Hey, hey, you're gonna get a lot of fire. Oh, oh, oh! I just sharted. <laughs> so, how about that Super Bowl? So try to guess who's gonna drop a bomb! Oh, I just sharted. Oh, Eric, I'm so hungry. Get something to eat. Yes. Yeah, you should probably just... <laughs> Come on! <laughs> I, I got that one perfect. <laughs> just gaze into each other's eyes. Jeez, <laughs> so loud. Don't think so, sir. <laughs> sir, take me. Yes! <laughs> Amen! <laughs>